Welcome everyone, in this short video I will show you how you can get things done on your iPhone using iPhone friendly version of Nosebee, your favorite simply get things done tool. Just go to inosebee.com and sign in using your email address and your password. Once you're logged into your, into your Nosebee account, as you, you can see your options. You can view your projects, your contacts, your next actions, or if you feel like typing, you can create new action, new project, or new context. And navigation is very simple and very intuitive. And, and most of all, it just feels like a native iPhone application. When you click on projects, you are quickly moved to a project list. You can always go back using the back button. Same applies to context. You can scroll down, up and down the context list, choose the context, go back, and go back again. If you, if you feel like you're checking your next actions right now, just click next actions. They will load right now. I have only one next action here. I can always go back if I want. Now, how do you um, manage your next actions or actions? Let's click on next actions again, and as you can see, Your, there's my action and what I can do if I, when I click on it I can delete it I can edit it just like that or I can change its time to whatever I feel like changing or I can just mark it as done and the action has been marked as done I can always go back go to projects go to my inbox there's nothing here the action has been done and there's one note but I can add a new action I can choose a context for it let's say office I can check time and go with next with the new action button and you can see it's here I could cancel I can see my list if I want to make an action a uh, uh, and next action I just click here and right now this action has become my my next action when I go back to my next actions list I can see it's here and it belongs to the project inbox I can mark it marked it as done or if I haven't done that yet I can mark I can undo this as you can see, it's very easy to navigate and very it feels like a native iPhone application. You can also work with your iNoseB uh, on your iPhone in landscape mode. Uh, you can see even more. Just click on next actions and you can see the buttons are bigger. And you can work any way you want. Now, um, let's feel like creating. Let's create a new action. Let's just put it here. And choose your project or context or time if you want to. You can even mark it as a new as a next action to directly add it to your next actions list and just add a new action it's been added let's go and see it in my next actions yes it's here iphone action the same applies to projects i can add a new project um, Yes, it has been added. Let's go to my projects and you can see these are my projects and the iPhone project has been just added. And when you choose to add a context, you can choose an icon for a context, whatever icon you wish. And just write the context name, let's say shopping. I'll go back, 
go to your context list and you can see shopping has been added here as you can see um, using iNoseB is very easy if you have a Noseby account um, it's, it's really easy to use it on your iPhone and feels like a native iPhone application have fun and let me know what you think and enjoy and most of all be productive and get more done and thanks bye